Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. Today I'm gonna show you a very simple Final Cut Pro technique which you can use to blur faces or censor body parts in your video. And before the start of this tutorial, please remember just to subscribe to this channel. I'll be giving you a lot of free stuff and tutorials, quick fixes and tips of Final Cut Pro, sometimes Da Vinci. And please remember to like this video as well. So let's get started. And the first step will be going to the effects tab and go to stylize and find sensor and just drag this to the clip very simple this is you know in circular shape and it's in the pixelate mode if you want to choose it you can choose to blur and you know it's become this kind of a foggy glass effect and obviously you can change the amount lower the amount or increase the amount and obviously you can invert the entire thing so this is kind kind of a focusing uh, to the center part of the video in this case or maybe you know into this drink if you want to and obviously you can decrease the amount so the focus will not be so obvious or so strong and obviously you can max out and of course you can use darken so this will be the only part that's showing something like James Bond and obviously you can choose to make it a rectangular one and you can always change the shape like this sadly the rectangle is sort of like a square in this case and you can't actually change much unless you you know alter the aspect ratio so please remember if you want to make it a very rectangular one you have to change the aspect ratio for this video this couple is you know jumping into the pool so there's a lot of movement so maybe just to illustrate i want to censor the tattoo of this guy the right arm and shoulder part i'm gonna enlarge the entire thing to be 100 percent to you know show you guys better before the start i'm gonna change this method to be blur and then i'm gonna change the amount to a slightly lower value around eight and then i'm gonna change the radius as well but that's not the end, I'm gonna go here, click this, uh, select add shape, so this creates a shape mask, first of all, you can change the shape, the feather, and the size, this entire shape mask. And that's just a, you know, very very rough draft of what the censorship will look like because I don't really have a lot of time so you guys just bear with me and you know, get the gist of what is happening and from now on I'm just gonna create a keyframe here at a keyframe and just press right arrow key and let's shift this thing you know following the entire half of the body movement you can always rewatch them and change accordingly so obviously you can change the size as well the rotation angle I'm just gonna fast forward to the end and just to have a quick tip if you don't want this uh, blurry thing to appear at a certain point you might want to create a keyframe here at the amount and maybe create another one here and maybe the part you want it to be disappearing you just drag it to zero and maybe when it starts to show the tattoo bring it back to eight but before the starting of this entire thing create another keyframe here and when it starts to show completely and just bring it up to eight and remember to drag this thing upwards and you know, shrink the size and angle and everything. The end result will be something like this. If you want to, you know, copy this entire thing and paste it over, say, to the face of this guy or the face of this girl, you can first click on this clip, press Command and C, and click on this clip again and press Command Shift and V and just paste the video effect sensor 
and since everything else is constant you might want to deselect or just keep it there it's the same so I'm just gonna paste the effect and uh, as you can see from the inspector there's another censorship mask over here you can choose differently you can just drag it over here and remember to change the center and also change it to rectangular and since there's a radio shape mask so uh, maybe I'm gonna change the size and the scale of this thing like this maybe and repeat the steps just now so to be very very bad and you know lazy this is the final result and hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial please remember to subscribe and like this video thank you very much and bye bye